Welcome to the vlog. It is Saturday afternoon. I've just watched qualifying for the Grand Prix. I've got about 20 minutes before I've got to leave the house to go to work. But I thought I'd get a quick bit of vlog recorded before we get off. So I've been very busy on the video content. So yesterday I recorded and put up the full review on the Avenger. So that is now up and live. Yesterday I also recorded the review for the Loop RDA. But I didn't get that put up because I didn't get the editing finishing finished. I was pretty knackered yesterday so I didn't get that finished. So I finished off the editing on that. Uh, that is now up. I've also done the juice reviews for all five of the Rose of Ivy juices. So those are up. And then I've also done an additional video on wicking, cleaning your wicks, cleaning your coils and wicking tips. So that is now up. So that's eight videos over two days. So I'm not going to put a vlog up today. That's going to be a bit too much, but I thought I'd jump on and get a little bit of vlog recorded. So at least I've got something on the go, ready, and hopefully I'll get the vlog finished off tomorrow. So I'm just about to head out the door. I've got work tonight. I'm working from half past five through till about midnight tonight. So it's a nice short shift for a Saturday. It meant I've got most of the day to myself. And then tomorrow I'm doing 10 hours. So I'm doing 12 till uh, 10 o'clock tomorrow or something like that. Can't remember the exact times, but I'm working tomorrow again. Uh, so it's not too early, but it's not too late. So I'm just getting myself all ready. I'm um, obviously going to take the Avenger with me. I'm going to take the Fit with me. Uh, this is loaded up with some Nick Salt juice that I got. I'm not going to review this, but I did get some Nick Salt juice. Uh, this is, uh, I can't even remember the name, Neon Green something. It tastes like Limeade is what it actually tastes like. Uh, but I put this into the Fit. I've also put it into the Vape Pen 22 to try it in there. I'm actually preferring it in the Vape Pen 22. But I wanted to try some Nick Salt juice in this. And that's pretty good. <coughs> this is a 20 milligram Nick Salt juice. And if I did try to do a 20 milligram free base nicotine, so standard nicotine, there's no way I'd be able to do, do an inhale on it. And with this I can. I did make a mistake. I did actually, when I first got this, I tried it on my dripper. And so I tried to drip it and man that burnt. But I wasn't really ready for that. So, uh, that's pretty much it for the minute. I'm going to get myself all sorted out. Got to get my bag put together, get myself out the door and get off to work. Uh, need to stop off, get some food and stuff. And the sun is shining, so I'm looking forward to this drive-in. The car's running fine again now. Uh, since I picked it up from the, gar from the garage the other day, it's running fine. So, that's good. Uh, the gas visit happened yesterday. I got most of my cleaning pretty much done, so... Living room's fine, kitchen's fine, bathroom's fine, bedroom's not quite there yet. Uh, but I'm still working on that, I'll get it there. And uh, that's pretty much it for the minute. So I'll check back in. If I get a chance to record something later on, I will. There might be a bit of car vlog, I haven't done that in a while. There might be a bit of out and about vlog, I don't know. Uh, but most likely I'm going to be recording the rest of this tomorrow morning before I go off to work. Uh, so hopefully you've checked out the videos that I've put up today. There's quite a lot there. Uh, it's eight videos over two days, so it's quite a lot of stuff. I'm not going to throw any links up because I'm limited to five. But do go check them out, especially the review on the Avenger and the review on the Loop. Those are both 25 minutes long. They're big videos. And it did take about three hours each to get them all shot and put together. So they're pretty, pretty epic videos that I've put there. Really happy with the results on them. And there's obviously some other stuff there. Okay, so I hope you're enjoying your weekend. And I'll check in with you again later on. So it is now Monday. Uh, it's been a couple of days since I shot that first bit of vlog. Uh, so Saturday went to work. Saturday night was fine. Got home pretty late on Saturday night. Uh, road works on the way home, so it took a bit later. And then yesterday was a long day in the office. I started at 12. I had to go in a little bit early so I could pick up some food and sort of drink on the way in. <clears throat> Got into work, did my shift, finished at about 10 o'clock last night, so it was late getting home as well. So it was a long day in the office yesterday, although on the upside, we've got Sky in the office, so I got to watch the Grand Prix, although the Grand Prix wasn't really that exciting. Uh, congratulations to Lewis, got a victory there, but it was a bit of a dull one, I'm afraid. It was a bit of excitement on the first turn, and then it was a snooze fest, so uh, these happen. We've had a few good races, and then we've had a bad one. Uh, so what have I been vaping over the weekend? Um, the Avenger. The Avenger's been in there. Definitely hanging in with the Avenger. Really good little vape. Uh, 
not 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 a little but that mesh coil that i've got in there that is starting to go uh so not sure if that will make it till the end of the week which is when i'll be able to order up some new coils so i've been using that uh also got the vape pen this has uh mostly nick salt juice in it i've mixed it a little bit because the nick salt i'm finding with the nick salt juice that i am coughing more from it and i think that could be because it's such a high level of nicotine that i'm not used to it but i do prefer it coming through the pen as opposed to the fit but been using this and of course the fit's still in rotation do like that going on and i've also been using the dead rabbit so i got the dead rabbit in the same day i got the loop in and because the loop needed to be reviewed, I haven't really spent much time with the Dead Rabbit. So I've put a new build in here with the Juggernaut. I've got it on the Athena at the minute because uh, it's got a fully charged battery. I've tried to drift it to the red resin, which I think looks really good on there. And I've just been using this. A little bit of spit back off that because it is a very low build that I've put in there. Uh, so that's been my main vapes for the time being. Uh, so today is Monday. Monday's going to be a quiet day, actually. Uh, no college today. The class has been cancelled. The lecture is not well. Uh, I do have some college work to work with. I've got some essays to, and assessments to be working on. So I'm going to do a bit of that. I've put up another video for my second channel. If you're not aware, I have set up a second channel, which is to do with weight loss. So it doesn't really tie in with any of the stuff on this channel, which is why I've set up this second set channel. But there's a second video up on there. Jump on over, go take a look if you want to take a look. Uh, there'll be a link in the description to jump over to that channel. I'll also throw a link up at the end. So feel free to jump over, take a look at that. And uh, I'm going to be doing some stuff for that channel today. And uh, also a bit of chill out. Uh, another thing I want to be doing is a couple of comment shout outs. Uh, I've had some nice comments come in, so I'm just going to throw them up so you can have a look at them. There's some nice comments. Well, the first comment is from the 101 Cleaning Coils and Wicking video, and it comes from Vista Vapors. Uh, they're just saying thanks very much for sharing this. Started using our RDAs and looking forward to tips on maintenance and using them. So that's a nice comment. Thank you very much, Vista Vapors. I did like give you a thumbs up on that one. Uh, the second comment that we have comes from Nathan Gaming, and he put it on the Vape Pen 22 review. 12 effing pounds. WTF, man. I got ripped off when I bought this from a shop. Loads of question marks there. I paid £22. FFS. Now, thank you, Nathan, for censoring yourself. I don't want to keep this channel child-friendly, but this made me smile. Uh, this was a nice little funny uh, comment. Did make me smile. So thank you, Nathan. Uh, perked me up when I was having a low moment when I seen this come in. So thank you a lot, Nathan. So there we go. A couple of nice comments there. If you want your comments read out on the vlog, leave some comments below. Uh, nice ones will get read out. If you want to leave me trolling comments as well, uh, I'm always up for a laugh. So feel free to leave them as well. Uh, but yeah, if you want to shout out in the comments below. Now I'm, I'm going to make a request to you guys that I'm looking for a new channel logo. This is Purple Mongoose. I want a Purple Mongoose channel logo. Can you draw? Can you do a picture? Can you use paint or whatever? Can you make a picture? What I'm looking for is a purple mongoose vaping. That's what I'm looking for for a logo. Now I would do this myself except I can't draw. I really can't. I've got no artistic merit at all. I've not got the skill to do it but I do want a logo for the channel. Uh, so if you are creative in any way shape or form and you can come up with an image like this for me i will be greatly appreciated if you're a vapor and you come up with something i'll throw something your way but uh i'm opening this up to the community out there if you've got something like that reach out to me if you can create something reach out to me through any of the social media channels that are available all the links are in the description you've got uh twitter facebook there's even an email address in there so if you can come up with something like that for the channel and you're happy for me to use it please go ahead and create it for me and send it on over and i will start using it uh 
much as I like having uh, the picture of Zorro there as a logo for the channel, it doesn't really say what the channel is having a picture of the cat. So uh, if you can come up with that image, I will be greatly appreciated. And that's going to be it for the minute. I'm going to crack on, do some stuff, and I'll come back a little later on, let you know what I've got up to and finish off the vlog. Hey guys, so it's a bit later on now, um, actually at my sister's house I'm sitting in the conservatory and I don't have anywhere to put the camera, so excuse any of the wobbles here. Uh, I have actually recorded the end of the vlog already, I recorded it before I left the house, so that will come after this. I just wanted to address a bit of the YouTube stuff that's going on at the moment. Uh, one of the channels that I follow, uh, Ryan Hall TV, has had a community strike. Now, if you don't know Ryan Hall, he does, he owns a vape shop in Kentucky, he does vape kind of related videos mostly he does comedy videos but there's a lot of vape involved but he's now had a community strike for content uh now i have watched all of his videos i've got no idea what he's got a strike for and i don't even know what video he has uh there's also the likes of grim green uh, another youtuber who does vape related stuff and he's he does a weekly vlog uh which i watch every week and he stopped doing his beer pairing section as well because that's part of it, but there seems to be a lot of vape related channels that are getting strikes at the moment. Now, I've always said that my channel is not a vape channel, but I do have a lot of vape content on here. So, uh, I'm a bit worried that I might be targeted for this as well, even though I'm just a small channel, I could very well be another one. So, it's just a quick message out, hopefully if I do get a strike on this, I have my second channel, so the vlog would move over there. Uh, but. I don't know how it works, I don't know whether if I get a strike on one channel whether it would affect both channels at the same time. I've not had any as yet and I don't think I've got any content up that would be affected by any of this. But it seems like they're going after vape channels and uh, as far as I know it's only US based vape channels so far but nothing's stopping them going after another UK vape, after another vape channel. So fingers crossed nothing comes of this and I don't get anything for it myself but much much respect going out to the guys out there that are getting affected by this uh, I know there have been a couple of channels that have been taken down completely uh, vape related content uh, just getting one strike and getting taken down so hopefully this doesn't affect me uh, directly but obviously it affects the community so send out good wishes to all the guys being affected by this and hopefully it's just uh, drop in the ocean is just it's just gonna pass it's not gonna be anything sort of major but uh, it does seem to be affecting mostly vape related channels I just want to jump on just give my two cents on that and now I'll go back to a couple of hours ago when I actually recorded the end of the vlog if that makes sense and once again sorry about the wobbly cam I am free free handing it at the minute and uh, like I say I'm in my sister's conservatory it has been a nice day uh, I'm doing a bit of babysitting at the minute so, uh, that's going to be it. We'll go back to the end of the vlog. So we're at a different angle here, and this is to finish off the vlog. Uh, I'm actually sitting at my desk here. I've been working away, doing a bit of study. It has been a beautiful day. I got out a bit earlier on, managed to get some walking done in the nice sunshine. Uh, it's about half past, half past six at night. Uh, but I'm going to have to end the vlog here because I've actually been asked by my sister to go do a bit of babysitting. Uh, that's because she's just finished up her exams. My sister's in university at the minute. She's finished up the exams for the year and all of her college mates are away out and Zorro has just jumped up on my back. This is his new favourite thing to do is jump on top of my back. Hey buddy. Yeah, he digs his claws in when he jumps up there. But So... This is his new favourite spot, and he pretty much sits on my head. So, we're going to wrap up the vlog uh, with Zorro. Uh, are you going to jump down, or are you going to stay put? He's going to jump down. So, there he goes. So, we got a visit from Zorro up there, and he's wrecking the place. And, as I said, my sister's at uni. She's having a night out with the people from her course who have finished their exams now. Uh, so she needs someone to go babysit for a few hours until her husband finishes work. So that's what I'm going to be doing for this evening. I've got to get over there for him for a set time. So that means I'm not going to get to do much more. I was going to do a bit more video today, but that's not going to happen. So this is going to be the end of the vlog for today. Uh, so 
all the usual good stuff like comment share subscribe go check out my other channel it's mongoose on a mission i've put up a second video on that channel today it's all about weight loss it's a weight loss journey so go check that out really 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 want your support over there if you could go help me out and give, go check out those videos give them a like subscribe to that channel as well It'll really help there'll be a link at the end uh and of course uh follow me on twitter the at one purple mongoose and of course there's the patreon as well www.patreon.com slash purple mongoose and as ever they bond.